It's your boy Dick with the mail. It's, it's Lou with On Deck TV. You know what I'm saying? I got sticks right here, man. We get it in with him, you know what I'm saying? Live and direct to you straight from the field, man. We checking in with our homie. What's up, man? What you got going on with B? Just working. Working B. Let's be working. Right working. Now, like I say. Alright, man. Listen, right now, that's real. I'm gonna hit first off, man. Tell them about the spring bling. It's man. underneath you the knob. You came out of nowhere. You, know I mean? the spring, you spring rocked bling. You rocked the little spring bling for deal. So tell them about that, man. What happened, man? First, I gotta give a uh, shout out to my own girl, Rusty Johnson. He's uh, who uh, helped me out with the spring bling. But basically, uh, I just, uh, you know what I mean? I gave him my mixtape and they yeah. called me back. Uh huh. It was, it was a blessing. Like it was just like, come on, come on, let's see what you can do. And then I got on there, I got cheated out. <laughs> David Banner was the judge, and he cheated me out. Shout Damn, out to David, David Banner, Banner, man. What's up? Shout man? out to David Banner. Come but on, let us. That was, uh, you know, what I mean, it was, a, it was a cool experience, man. Mm -hmm. Before that, mm -hmm. how long had you been working? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? What got you to that point? You know what I mean, your your experience. Oh, that point. I, I, I had about two weeks there. Two weeks there. Broadway. Like my brother. He had both of them. Shout out to Broadway. Yeah, I see him on deck. You know what I mean? And uh, he produced both of my mixtapes. And at that point, I had just been, you know what I'm saying, working, working at FedEx, uh, getting money. Yeah, in the studio, I, 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 I didn't realize I came here. I went to the park, went straight to the studio. Uh -huh. And I did that. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's 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 how I came. Like, a nigga, I, I was really just working, man. Just working, just pounding, yeah. working. I get off work, go to the studio, go to sleep, sitting there grinding day after day. I feel you, man. Um, what you got coming up, man? What you been working on currently? Speaking of work, what you been working on? You feel like what's new from Sticks? What I've been working on, man. Is, uh, I've been working on uh, producing some songs for Sticks. You know what I'm saying? Like uh, I just actually I just put out a mixtape online in France with DJ Pimp. Shout out DJ Pimp. What up, DJ yeah. Pimp in France? Yeah, it was cool. It's available online, actually. Email me at sticksiza at gmail.com and you can get that free. I'll give you the link. Okay. And uh, <clears throat> basically, the link on my MySpace is myspace.com slash sticksiza. But uh, I mean, I just did that mixtape with him. I've been working with a uh, producer uh, named Craig King, man. Yeah, man, we met with Craig down there. Love Noise, he put on real yeah, big for us. Shout out to Craig, man. Shout out to Craig King. We gotta really catch him down in there. Hey, man, we on our way here. <laughs> and, uh, you know what I'm saying? I've been working on working on records with him, man. We just did a song yesterday. Yeah. What type of tracks y'all been in, man? Like how what y'all what y'all hey, ladies really, and like what you just really the song yeah, the song yesterday was just really telling uh the kids that we stay away. The song was called Stay Away and it was just saying stay away from drugs, stay away from the nonsense. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, okay. So that that's that's that was the aim. Trying to get a positive message out right. there for you the kids. You know, so it's just something making something happen like in a positive direction for the uh, youth. And primarily the black youth. Black males uh, really was the aim for that. And uh me yeah, that's what we've been doing. I did a track actually with a uh, cat named like Julian Johnson. He's an R&B singer called Seraphine. Uh, he Craig King produced it. Okay. That's that's the one I performed with the Love Noise. Okay, yeah, yeah. I checked that out, I checked that out. I've been meaning that's what I Everybody asks me when they when it sticks come up, where you get your name from, Sticks? You know what I'm saying? Like oh, I ain't never knew, you know what I mean? When somebody asked me, well, yeah, tell, tell them where they came from. my pops, man. I got the name from my father. Uh -huh. He used to call him, people used to call him Stick Willie. Uh -huh. And his home, his, his friends used to call me uh, Little Sticks. Little Sticks. So, just, so then I did a song with my freshman year. I went to Belmont too. Right. And then my song, I did a song called Sticks Isla. Uh -huh. And so my, well, actually Broadway produced that CD too. Yeah. It was number three. And uh, you know what I'm saying, my uh, my roommate just, he just stuck with me. He just called Sticks. me Isla. He called me Isla. Yeah. And then eventually, it, Brian Collins, man, he played uh, basketball at Bill Mama. Shout out to Penny. Shout we out know Penny, 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 man. What's up, Penny? We know Penny. Penny. And he, you know what I'm saying? They call me Izzy. So, I mean, it's just a bunch of Okay, well, we here with Izzy. We're going to come back after we get these sticks commercial sticks. breaks in, you know what I mean? We'll holler at you in a minute. Home Deck TV, Lou. I'm out. Lou checking back in with the man, Sticks Izzy from the Ville. Home Deck TV, we dodging moths and everything, you know what I'm saying? Getting it in. What up, man? <laughs> you know what I mean? Right back from commercial break. Bro, tell us about Envious Entertainment, you know what I'm saying? Tell us about Envious. Oh, Envious Entertainment is a uh, label. They had a uh, Spell it out for them, too. Let them know how it's Envious Entertainment. Uh, it's uh, uh, actually from uh, my man. He, he started the label. His name is Big Homie. Shout out to Big Homie. And uh, basically, it's, he got a you know, label. He has about uh, four or five artists on the label. Mm -hmm. Rap, is it majority rap or how we do rap? You know, I mean, hip hop, hip hop. He kind of took that this way, you know, kind of like made a home for me. And I can record it, you know what I'm saying? Really, really. Shout out to Big Homie. Messing with me, that's my dude. That's what's up with the NBA and the time, you know what I'm saying? 
Back in with Sticks on Deck TV. Let us know about, you know what I'm saying, the producers that you like working with in the city. Like, we already decided our man Broadway out. We know you get it in with Broadway. It's like family. But step outside of Broadway and tell us who else you work with, who else get it in, who, who else get it in. You know what I mean? Anyway, you know what I'm saying? Start in the field and go in. Nashville, primarily, man, like, of course, it's Broadway. Yeah. Off jump. It's Broadway. That's my curve, man. Really? Like, that's, that's, that's family, though, so that goes without saying. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Faith Eastwood, too. You know Shout out to Faith. What up, homie? Yeah. Faith Eastwood, that's, that's my dude, man. Like, okay. that's, that's my man. But, uh, actually, actually, Faith just jumped on a song that Broadway produced called Money Clap. I said, you got yeah. Faith on that rap. You know, Faith too many. I'm like, too many people don't get faith to rap, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, yeah, so yeah, yeah, you got faith out there to rap, you know what I mean? It gotta be a little hot track for y'all. What's the name of it? It's called Money Clap. Money Clap. I did the song, I did it, I recorded it in Charlotte. Okay. And uh, actually, All Star just jumped on the track. Shout out to All Star. Shout out to Star, what up, bro? And uh, yeah, actually, it's me, Faith, and All Star. Yeah, Faith, 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 Hey, shout out to Coop. I know y'all seen him on deck. He ripped the Lord. Make the beat thing, you know what I'm saying? Coop goes in. Coop goes in. Coop goes in. Shout out to Mo too. Uh, outside of that, I mess with a cat named uh, Black Tobin, man. Black Tobin. Black Tobin. He's from uh, Los Angeles. He's from Los Angeles. Man, I'm yeah, from Envious Camp. Okay. And, uh, he, he, he produced some songs off my release that I'm going to come out with, man. It's called Off on My Story. It's really yeah. an album. But I'm releasing it just like by myself. Street Out. Yeah. Street Out. Okay. And uh, Black Tobin. Yeah, he, he, he produced a lot of amazing tracks. Another producer I work with is Black Shields. Y'all ever heard the song uh, called It's Like It's Like Romeo and Juliet? Yeah. Like six, okay. Yeah. okay, yeah. He, he produced that. Actually, that's him singing on the track. Too. And uh, where he from? He from uh, he from LA. Too. Both from from LA. I don't know if he from Los Angeles. He from California. Okay. I can't even pinpoint. I can't pinpoint. Y'all yeah, West, West, West Coast. He a West Coast guy. I met him in Envious Camp too. And uh, King Keys out there in Envious too. Keys produce a lot of money. He get it in a lot out west, right? Yeah, because the, the CEO from Envious is he from LA, so we got a lot of connections out there. That's real. But I got a producer two names. Right? I ain't gonna cut you off. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead. Red Line from West Virginia. Red line. Okay. He, so, he got two. He got two on my uh, new stuff. And then of course Craig. Yeah, right? yeah Craig. Craig Shout out to Big Homie Craig, man. He showed us real love and love once again, man. Uh, we gotta get to the commercials, man. On Deck TV, we gotta sign out for a little second, man. We'll be back in a second. Holler, Lou Sticks.